They have whiskers. Their ears are really pointy. And they have really long tails. But in Singapore, their tails are usually short or bendy. They have really sharp claws. And they have sharp teeth too. They're also really lazy. Until dinner time, that's when they run to the football. I get really excited at dinner time too. In this episode, we're talking about cats. Can you just teach us? Cats are so cute! Except for the sadness ones to scare me a bit. That's a sphinx cat. As my mom would say, no hair, no mess, no cleanup. We don't have to bathe cats as often as dogs. That's because cats are very good at licking themselves clean. But they do shed hair everywhere, which is why my parents have to do a lot of vacuuming. My cat is always sleeping. That's because they are crepuscular. It means they're most active in the early mornings or evenings. When cats are active, they can be really playful. They will chase balls. Jump to catch things. They can jump up to more than a meter high. They love squeezing into small spaces too. Their whiskers are long as their bodies are wide. Which means they'll know if a space is too tight for them to fit. And if there's a box, they'll always want to sit in it. Or when my mom is on the computer, the cat will sit on the keyboard. That's because cats are naturally curious. They have to know what's going on. That sounds like my baby sister. She always wants to know what's going on all the time. My daddy says being curious is a really good thing. It's what helps us to learn. So Isaac Newton discovered gravity because he was curious why things fall down. And not up. I learned how a clock worked because I was curious on how its hands move so precisely. It's why cats like to be up in high places. From there, they can observe things and feed their curiosity. We go to school to feed our curiosity. Books can help too. And cats never stop being curious. That's like what my dad says too, that we should never stop being curious and learning. Even when we're adults. Even when we're adults. My mom just finished a short course on marketing. She says it'll help her work better. She's a curious adult cat. <laughs> Cats are so curious. They love to investigate about everything too. What's behind a closed door? What's at the end of a string? And adult cats do that too. Being curious helps us learn so many things. Why some things make people sad? Why other things can make people mad? Why can't things what they really do? Why we do some things the way we do? As the Bible says, how much better to get wisdom than gold, to get inside rather than silver. Cats or humans will always have something new to learn. And, and it's great, great to always be curious. curious. What will you learn about today?